Hi guys, welcome to my channel. My name is Joanna and uh, today I'm tuning in from Paradise. I'm on holidays on this lovely island just off the coast of Belize. Uh, it's called Key Falcon. And today I have a quick beach sequence for you. You don't need a mat. It's all standing asinus and it's only seven minute long. So hope you enjoy it. All right, so we're gonna get started in your mountain pose. Feet hip distance apart arms by your sides, your palms facing forwards. Breathe in and ground through your feet, lengthen through your spine, stand tall, relax your shoulders and bring your focus to your breath. Start breathing in through your nose and out through your nose. Now breathe in and reach your arms up and sit into your chair, reaching your arms overhead. Can you look up and lengthen through your spine? Lift your right leg up and step it back into your high lunge, reaching your arms up. Send your arms to the back, interlace your fingers, pull your hands down to open your chest. Can you sink deeper with your hips and look up? Breathe in, reach your arms up and open up into your warrior two. Double check your front knees directly above your ankle. Now breathe in, send your left elbow towards your left knee, left thigh, and reach the opposite arm up into your extended side angle. Now, can you reach the, uh, the left arm overhead as well, adding a little bit more challenge to your core? Breathe in, come back, warrior two. And straighten out your front leg when you're ready. Tiptoe or heel to toe your back foot a little bit closer. Breathe in into your trikonasana, your triangle pose. So your left arm is just in front of your shin, your knee, your thigh, or your ankle. Breathe in to come back up and reverse your triangle. Both legs are straight, chest is open. Breathe in to come back, warrior two. And inhale, high lunge. Breathe in, step your right leg up, right knee up and come back into your mountain pose. Arms by your sides, then breathe in and sit into your chair again. Let's bring it to the other side. Can you look up, lengthen through your spine? Left foot lifts up and step it right back into your high lunge. Look up if you can. Send your arms to the back, interlace your fingers, pull your hands down, really open your chest. Breathe in, reach your arms up and open up into your warrior two. Extended side angle. So drop your right elbow this time, left arm reaches overhead, lengthening through that side body nicely. And if that's available, can you send that right arm overhead as well, really opening your chest to the front and straightening through your core really reaching, reaching your arms away. Breathe and come back into your warrior two. Nice and strong, can you sink deeper? Breathe and straighten that front leg, heel to toe your back foot. Both legs are straight, nice and strong. And tip it forwards into your trikonasana, your triangle pose. Keeping your top wrist above your shoulders, shoulders stacked one on top of the other open through your chest through your collarbones breathe in come back up and reverse your triangle so you can slide your left hand down your back leg and reach the opposite arm overhead breathe in come back warrior two breathe in open up into your high lunge step your left foot or bring your left knee up and take it back down into your mountain pose, arms by your sides, chest lifted, come back into your breathing, ground through your feet. We're going to get into a little bit of uh, balancing now, so when you're ready, you can bring your feet closer together. Good, and we're going to start with your tree pose, so bring your right foot up. Uh, press it against the inner 
part of your left thigh if that's available if not bring it below the knee or just to your ankle that's totally fine whatever works for you today bring your hands to your heart center when you're ready breathe in and reach your arms up separate out your hands and stay strong now feel free to stay here if this is challenging enough for you if you can come with me Take your right hand, place it outside your right knee and rotate that knee to the side. Left arm reaches to the left and look towards that left hand if you can. Stay here or as you can, interlace your fingers around your right big toe and can you extend that right leg forwards or open it to the side as you can. It doesn't have to be straight. You can have it slightly bent and bring it back into your tree pose. Bring your hands back to your heart center and release it back down. Let's take it to the other side. Left foot again against the inner thigh of your right leg or bring it below the knee or to your ankle. Never against your knee. Reaching your arms overhead, if you can, separate out your hands. Can you look up? Can you lift that left knee and rotate it out to the side? A little bit challenging on the sand here. Right arm to the side. Can you look towards that right side? Beautiful. And if you can, can you interlace? your fingers around your big toe, can you extend that leg out to the side, reaching, reaching your heel up, extending the leg if you can fully, standing strong and slowly come back. Bring your hands to your heart center. And release it back down. Well done, everyone. You can come back to your mountain pose. So just where we started. You can close your eyes and slowly come back into your natural breathing. Now, thank you so much for joining me today. May your days be happy, healthy and full of love. Breathe and reach your arms overhead. Bring your hands to heart center and bow forward with gratitude. Namaste, see you again.